compost time is here everyone put compost in your beds today i'm just going to do a little bit of a little bit of a fun example of putting compost into your beds We've got all kinds of good compost right here this is actually mushroom compost and uh we're talking high quality stuff here it's been decomposing for quite a while it's mostly grass based usually you have either grass based or tree based I like, I like uh, to do a combination because grass-based generally has more bacterial-based um, decomposition, whereas tree or wood chip or you know that kind of stuff, green waste, that generally is more fungal. So if you add the two together, that's the best of both worlds. But this stuff is awesome. It's been decomposing a long time. So we're gonna take it and put it in these beds for this school here. It's gonna be fun, let's do it. This is our first dump right in here trying to get it up to about here with the compost and then I'll go the rest up here with wood chips. I'm not worried about this grass here because if I cover it up thick enough it should just die off. Some of these tougher weeds like the maybe the nettles or the dandelions should come up so if I see some dandelions I'll pull them out. We'll find mushrooms there. Hey buddy. But yeah gonna try to bring it up here and that's gonna be good so as I'm spreading this out I wanted to explain compost a little bit a lot of times people are like yeah put compost put compost but do we really understand the benefits it's it's having on what you're putting on your garden or your raised bed or your even your just your your berry bushes or even ornamental bushes fruit trees what's it actually doing well What's going on, at least part of it, is it's adding organic matter, which helps with soil um, water retention. And then also it's helping with a whole bunch of soil life, soil biota. So bacteria, fungi, those guys are having fun. They're fun guys whenever the soil is um, has a diversity of minerals, nutrients, and decomposing materials. So that's the key is keep your garden having a high degree of, of organic materials that's decomposing all the time. Keep a layer of decomposing material on top. You don't have to mix it in either. That's a, that's a uh, myth. So just keep it on top because you don't see that happening in nature. What you see in nature is every year, the previous year's growth dies and lays on top of the ground. So that's part of what um, adding compost does it also um, will it's almost like it, giving probiotics to plants as well because it increases the bacteria and fungi and also other stuff there it is everybody thumbs up look at that it's all in there looking good covered up it's good compost happiness happiness and that my friends that's how you do it add compost now i might come back in with wood chips um, just to benefit the soil biota life but compost is a great start i encourage, highly encourage you go ahead find some awesome compost add it to your garden beds your raised beds and you will be very very happy you did all right catch you all later see you next time on the garden guy channel stay tuned for more funness it's good times.